Have you updated your iOS or if you're having trouble with CarPlay connecting in general, I'm going to walk you through some troubleshooting steps. Usually what I will do to get CarPlay working again, if it's not connecting, if you go in here and you're trying to connect to your phone and it says uh, waiting CarPlay UI or uh, tap to connect, connecting, waiting UI kind of goes in limbo between them. Um, I'm going to show you the steps of how I usually will fix that. First step I will do is, let's say you're on this screen, I'll go to the home screen, top left circle. Then I will go to the two small dots on the lower portion of the screen and I'll go to settings. After going to settings, go to network and internet. There's three dots up here in the small uh, corner. Go ahead and select reset Wi-Fi, mobile, Bluetooth and reset settings. The network settings have been reset. The next thing we will do is we will go back one, two, three pages and scroll to the very bottom. You'll see system. Right here you'll see VLINE system updates. Scroll down to reboot VLINE. Do you really wish to reboot VLINE? Yes. Next steps we'll perform on the phone. What we'll do is we'll go to Bluetooth sure we uh, delete the v-line from the memory I have a few here since uh, obviously we're working with a few at a time all right so I don't have a v-line in my Bluetooth I'm gonna go to general carplay same thing you're gonna want to forget all right so I have no carplay devices in here if I go to Bluetooth there's nothing there the next thing I'll do is just as I rebooted the v-line I'm gonna restart my phone now the phone I'm using is on iOS 16, so this should be good for whoever's watching this that updated and might be having issues. Press the first dot here or just make sure you're on the first page with your Apple CarPlay shortcut. Your phone needs to be on the Bluetooth screen, Bluetooth turned on, searching for devices. You'll see a circle spinning right there. Right here we see iPhone. We got a pairing code to both devices. I'm going to allow contacts and press pair on both devices. And when this switches to waiting CarPlay UI, the phone will get a pop up that says use CarPlay. Select use CarPlay. And this is where you just wait for it to connect. Uh, sometimes that could take 30 seconds. Um, sometimes it could take a minute. Just be patient during that process. And in this case, it paired right away.